Great question. Um, that's one of the things when they talk about the early New Orleans music as being the foundation of the blues and predating what came later in the Mississippi Delta. Right. For those who don't know, the Mississippi Delta, the first recordings from the Mississippi Delta didn't happen until around 1928. Uh, you know, Charlie Patton recorded in 1929. That's one of the, that's, he's supposed to be the founder of the Delta Blues, so to speak. Robert Johnson, whom everybody has heard of, he didn't start recording until around 1935. The blues had already been performed in New Orleans from the early 1890s, predating the music business. And then when it finally got on record, the recordings were so primitive, you could not, um, the early recording, you could not have anything under, say, 500 hertz, meaning that you could not, the bass player, he might come to the recording session and he might be a part of the band, but they wouldn't let him play. Mm. 